A further progression for the Palof press is potentially the most demanding of the Palof press variations, which is a single leg Palof press. So there are two ways to do it. We can be on the leg closest to the anchor of the band, or we can be on the one furthest away. The most difficult is the leg furthest away. So let's begin with the leg closest. So we grab the band between the hands, clasp the fists and bring it in. Now keep the hands there where you put the body weight onto the left side for me. So this is the leg closest to the anchor point. And then we're going to stabilize ourselves, squeeze the glutes, keep a tight core, neutral spine, and then pushing away and then back in, just like we would for a standard power press. Okay, and when we're comfortable with that, we can move on to the opposite leg. This is going to twist us around a bit more, so it's going to be a bit more demanding for the rotators of the spine and the glutes and everything else that stabilizes this right hip in a single leg stand. So back into that start position, brace the core, neutral spine, weight over the top of the far away leg from the anchor, keeping the core tight, you'll feel the demands on the core increase as you move away from your body. Don't give that core a moment off, keep it nice and tight. Thinking about the right glute to stabilize the hip as we go.